So this time of the year, during the springtime, the common frogs and the common toads are starting to breed and lay eggs. And very often I get a lot of questions asking about how they can adapt to the different temperatures. So we recently had some really cold weather where the ponds started to ice over and that can affect some populations of common frogs and common toads. So during that time, underneath that thick layer of ice, what's starting to happen is the leaf litter and plant matter starting to decompose. And that can release toxic gases. And unfortunately, that can be fatal to the amphibians that are living below that surface. However, some amphibians can survive this. And usually the best way to help them survive this is to remove the leaf litter at the end of the breeding season in the summer. Common frogs have been known to breed in December, but usually they'll breed in January. Common toads, they're breeding around this time of year, between February and March, and they're leaving people's gardens and the woodlands where they've been living over the summer, autumn and winter to migrate back to the ponds. Unfortunately, when they're making their way back to the breeding sites, very often they'll get run over by cars. And over 20 tonnes of toads get run over annually in the UK. However, there are people that go out between six and eight at night and they'll help the toads cross the roads. They're called toad patrollers. And the reason why they do it between six and eight is obviously because it's during that heavy traffic period and that's when the toads are on the move, just as it's starting to get dark. 